Hello, Andy Graham of uh, Digital Nomad Traveler trying to show you another little travel tip on your computer. I have, uh, I have a fan and a computer and of course an extension cord. So this is the fan. We have a huge rainstorm so I'm having to move the, the computer away from the window. I was a little, I had it kind of in the wrong place. So here's the computer. I'm moving to the center of the room away from the rain. But as you can see, right now I have this extension cord and both the fan and the computer are plugged in the same extension cord. I don't do this. I always try to separate the circuits a little. It's not like you're really going to get a separate circuit. But uh, what I'm going to do right now is unplug the fan and plug it in over here on the wall. Now the, the reason for this is that I'm trying to slow down on the... Uh, the low current problem. Sometimes you'll have a low current problem and it'll burn up the black box. Anything that's uh, too much or too little, normally it's too little, but this is the black box on your computer and it will actually burn up. It's a transformer. It's, it's reducing 220.110 down to 19 volts or something like that. And it'll burn up from low current. So what you're trying to do is kind of isolate this circuit and only have things on there on your on your wall socket that is one. Now, according to how many breakers and all that stuff in a room and all that stuff, you, you've had a lot of variations. But what you're trying not to do is obviously a fan, will, you know, a fan motor will create a lot more electricity draw than uh, other things. Big storm going on here in Thailand. 